Hey Grade Fours, my name is Alex and I work at the St. Albert Public Library. I'm here today to share with you a few of my picks from the Grade Four book list, picked especially for Grade Fours going into Grade Five. Um, here's my first one. This is Max and the Midnights by Lincoln Pierce. And Max and Uncle Budrick are troubadours traveling through different kingdoms, playing music, telling jokes, but Max doesn't want to be a troubadour. Max wants to be a knight. So when Uncle Budrick goes missing after he's captured by an evil king, Max and new friends, the Midnights, have to save Uncle Budrick and possibly the whole kingdom of Bijovia. If you like books that have graphics in them, if you like adventure stories, and if you like surprises, this would be a great one to try. All right, my next one is called Beastly Puzzles by Rachel Poliquin. This is a really neat book. It has openable flaps and it's a short one. This one's really cool because it is based on how natural historians and explorers used to describe animals based on familiar things. So could you think of an animal that's maybe made up of parts of a rubber ducky, a bouncy ball, and two marbles? Me neither. I didn't know. If you open this book, you'll find lots of animal facts, lots of animal riddles. Again, short pick, great pick. Try this one out. My last one I don't have. Somebody has it out from the library. It's A Wolf Called Wander. Um, it's inspired by the true story of a wolf called Or7. This book is intense and fast-paced, and some characters die and disappear. There are some territory fights. There are some unpleasant interactions with humans. Um, there's an animal birth scene. There's hunting. This book is not for the faint of heart. So if you are bothered by that type of thing, maybe don't try this book quite yet, or maybe wait a year. Um, but if you want a book that is fast-paced, survival-based, and you want to know about the real lives of wolves and other predators, this is a really cool choice. And it's uh, based on a true story, which is really awesome. Um, I've picked some other great books. I'm going to put a slide up at the end um, that you might want to take a screenshot of or uh, get a pencil and paper. Uh, and if none of these appeal to you, you can get a personalized book list by checking our website, sapl.ca, and you can also check back there about our summer reading game, which is coming up. So we'd love for you to play the game and read with us this summer. I'm going to put the slide up here. There we go. Thanks so much. Bye. Books labeled library means that there might be a copy available to check out from the library. Libby and Hoopla are both digital formats, so you would need a device to download the ebook or e-audiobook to listen to or read. 